Well, let's continue our coverage of today's top story. The Senate Banking Committee holding its first hearing on the recent bank crisis caused by the collapse of regional banks Silicon Valley Bank and Signature Bank. Here with more, Yahoo Finance's Jennifer Schoenberger. Hey, Jennifer. Good morning, Rochelle. That Senate Banking Committee hearing with regulators on why Silicon Valley Bank failed underway right now. Out of the gate, lawmakers had searing comments for witnesses. Chairman Sherrod Brown said he wants to propose legislation that will better enable regulators to reprimand executives. Take a listen. It will surprise no one in Ohio that these bank executives face less accountability than a cashier who miscounts the cashier's box, the cash box. That's, that's why I'll be introducing legislation to strengthen regulators' ability to impose fines and penalties, to claw back bonuses, to ban executives who cause bank failures from ever working in another bank. Republican ranking member Tim Scott also had searing comments saying, quote, this is a classic tale of negligence and it started with the banks themselves without any question. That's where the buck stops. So it is imperative that we hear straight from the horse's mouth, so to speak, to find out why these banks were so poorly managed and so poorly managed the risks. Now, the Fed vice chair of supervision, uh, Michael Barr said SVB failed because the bank's management did not effectively manage interest rate and liquidity risk. He said that the firm was weight rated three on a scale of uh, five being the best, uh, meaning that it was not well managed and that it rated deficient at a company management level. He also said the Fed is going to be thorough and overreaching in its own review of itself to see where it fell down on the job. Now, FDIC Chair Martin Grunberg said their central concern when SVB failed was that the evidence suggested there was significant risk of contagion, and that is why they swooped in with the actions that they did so swiftly. He said over the weekend there, were, there was serious stress at other institutions and the knock-on effects of that contagion, and that is why they did what they um, decided to do. He said had they not acted, the situation would have been much worse. Now, for her part, Under Treasury Secretary Nellie Lang said that regulators are prepared to take the steps they already did uh, to pr better protect depositors if there were to be more future runs. This hearing underway right now and ongoing. I will bring you those headlines as I get them. Back to you. All right. Appreciate it there. Jennifer Schoenberger there for us.